My dear, do you think destiny is fatal? Who controls this life? Man or God? Is it possible to change something in your destiny? Let me tell you a story right now. A student came to us and we saw her destiny. Her astrological chart told us that she was bound to have a very serious accident that would result in her death. She was destined to die. Of course, when we see such a situation, we use our most powerful rituals to call on the spirits. We ask them how to help a person. At that time, we posed a question to the spirits, and they did us a favor and told us that the woman's fate could have several options. The first option was that if she did not change anything in her life, she would have an accident, and she would end up in a subtle world, and she would die. The second option of her destiny was that if she performed a certain ritual in her life, then the following scenario might happen. The woman might crash her car completely, but the woman would remain healthy and unharmed. The third scenario of her destiny was the woman was driving the car, nothing happened to her or the car, and the accident never happened. Nothing happened. Then we asked the spirits, Spirits, what are we to do? How can we make this difficult karmic situation go away completely? We had been praying for the destiny of that woman for a very long time. We picked a special amulet for her. We performed a special shamanic ritual for her, during which the spirit showed her what she needed to do. The spirits told her, Open your heart. Your lineage has lived for itself for too long. Now you must look for the people who need your help. Please, look around you and find the people who need your help. And she responded, My God, there are so many people around me who are suffering and are in dire straits. A friend of mine is suffering from depression and is about to commit suicide, and I don't know what I can do to help her. Then she started praying for her. She learned that there was a nursing home in her town where elderly people lived alone without love or care. She went there and began spending evenings with them. She would just come to talk and socialize with them. Thanks to those actions, the karmic situation in her lineage changed. That day, that magical day when the accident was supposed to happen, we all prayed because every step and every emotion on that day could change anything. But we were sure that everything would be okay because the power of the shamanic ritual and the power of the shamanic amulet were protecting that woman. So on that day, she left the apartment where she lived and saw her neighbor's little boy playing nearby. He was controlling his small toy car with the remote, and the car crashed into her foot. The car only left a small bruise. That's how the scenario of her destiny was magically played out. Yes, a car crashed into a person, but it was only a small toy car that left a small bruise on her body. When she stopped, she felt that her amulet of power fell down and broke into ten pieces. When she brought us her amulet, she said, My God, it saved me. It absorbed a negative blow that was meant for me. We realized that the ten shards of that amulet were the ten people she had helped during that time. Thanks to those acts of kindness, the scenario of her destiny, which had been negative and resulted in a fatal accident, ended with a simple, everyday situation. You should know that any situation in your life, no matter how difficult or critical it may seem to you, can be changed. My dear, you, yourselves of course, 
don't know what the right way to do things is. And it is for this very reason that there have always been shamans in the world who show a person the way, where to go, how to act, and how to change one's destiny. I know that some of you have already started using shamanic cards to get everyday advice from an oracle, but situations are different. So please, the first thing you should do is write to me. Call me to find out what to do in difficult situations. God sees thousands of scenarios for each person. If in your situation you only see one way out or do not see it all, you should know that at this moment in time, your eyes are closed. The evil spirits may have closed your eyes and you do not see anything. Like a blind man, you are meandering in lurches, but you are not. Good spirits and angels are your helpers. They will always be by your side. It is a shaman who is able to help you and to give an opportunity to each of you to change your destiny completely through a ritual, through a magic amulet, through a power seminar, or wise advice. So you should know that your destiny is not fatal. Everything depends on your choice. If you find it difficult to immediately give up attachments and bad habits that create problems, you need a talisman and a special ceremony that will be held by a shaman at our seminar. Also, we invite you to visit the group and bring new women to the classes.